We have new information tonight in the shooting of five people in South Norfolk. Thanks for joining us at 5. I'm Nicole Live. I'm Dan Kennedy. Chesapeake police say a shooting that killed a 14 year old boy and injured four others, including two minors, happened because of a fight. Emily Harrison is live on Drayton Road with an update from police and city leaders. So, Emily, what have you learned? Well, Chesapeake police say they are still investigating what exactly led up to this fight. But at this point, they believe that there could be multiple suspects involved in it. Now, this fight and this shooting led to the death of one 14 year old boy and four others are still recovering in the hospital. Two minors and two adults have non life threatening injuries after Chesapeake police say multiple people might have fired guns Saturday afternoon on Drayton Road. It's only two blocks away from Thurgood Marshall Elementary School. Chesapeake Mayor Rick West says he got an alert about the shooting just an hour after it happened. We were all notified, all the council at the same time, and obviously I was uh, disturbed by it. A 14 year old boy died from the shooting. Leo Kaczynski, a spokesman for Chesapeake Police, says at this time they are not releasing the boy's name. The incident is considered to be the most injured party shooting this year in the city of Chesapeake. We all have to learn to use kinder words and to not let disagreements rise to that level. So far, Chesapeake Police have not charged anyone with the shooting, but Kaczynski says there should not be a threat to the public. One neighbor tells 13 News Now she's still concerned because the shooting happened right next to her child's bus stop. Knowing that it happened so close by, I know a neighbor's car was hit. Um, it's extremely concerning. Mayor West says the true victims are all of the impacted families hurt by this violence, and he says his heart is with them. There's a family somewhere that's hurting or friends somewhere that are hurting. I mean, these are families whose lives are affected forever. Now, Wes says that he is urging families to talk to their children about the effects of gun violence and to talk to police if they have any information about this shooting. Live in Chesapeake, I'm Emily Harrison, 13 News Now. And if you have any information, call the crime line at 1-888-LOCK-YOU-UP. And remember, you can remain anonymous. Emily, thank you.